We're at the 4J Annual Awards We're with Catherine Merry, one of our guests of honour on Saturday evening in Glasgow. How pleased are you to be here, Catherine? Very pleased. Um, I've never heard anything but fabulous things about the Scottish Awards. So to actually come this year and, and be a part of it, I'm, I'm absolutely honoured to be asked and delighted to be here. The, the, the vibe already just walking in has been, has been pretty special after such a great year. Well, you've been steeped in the sport, I think, for, for 35 to, to 40 <laughs> years, perhaps. How important is it that Scottish Athletics recognise clubs, coaches, volunteers and officials, you know, the backbone of the sport? Massively, massively important that everybody that plays a role in our sport, whatever that role is, is recognised and, you know, had a little doff of the cap. It's, it's, it's a very important evening because people need to feel like they're playing their part, which they do here. So, no, it's, it's, it's wonderful to look at the programme and see how many awards are being handed out for so many different things, because it, it is important. Every area needs to be recognised and rewarded. Well, you're watching from afar in a sense, but, but you're also been very close to the action in some major stadiums, uh, stadia and, and events and so on. What do you feel is driving those top Scottish performances? I'd love to know what's driving those top Scottish performances. All of us in England want to know what's driving those top Scottish performances. I sat and I thought about it and I went, I know exactly what it is. I think that every level of, of Scottish athletics has a respect for each other and an understanding of each other and therefore it just works together. It's a whole big picture, it's a whole big family that gets the success at the top level and then from the grassroots up because everybody plays their part and that's acknowledged and rewarded in so many ways. So I, I, I can see why it works now because you guys do it very well. So before we finish, Catherine, just tell us a little bit about that moment in Oregon when you were watching Jeff commentate <laughs> on, uh, on Jake Whiteman's world title. Uh, what, what a moment, what a place to be. I think, I think myself and Jeff, or Jeffers, as I call him, because we're very good friends, um, never, uh, it's never a miss what a special seat and role that we play in terms of what we witness and what we call in terms of races. And Jeff only ever asks for one race in any major championships, and it's the men's 1500 metres, in case special moments like that happen with Jake. It was outstanding. I've, I've been involved in and witnessed many super things in track and field in my life that is on the podium. What Jake did was an absolute tactical masterclass and to have Jeff and, and Susan there as well in Oregon to, to witness it and to see them witness it was, it still get, gives me goosebumps still today. It was, it, was, it was pretty special. Thanks very much, Catherine.